name is Charlie Schmidt. Keyboard Cat is a strange thing that just happened. You can't do it on purpose, that's for sure. This, there's no there's no recipe or anything like that for a meme. I made the, these videos because I happened to have a video camera back then. This is in 84. Most people didn't have just TV stations had them. So I just experimented making the day just go a little smoother for myself. You know, what do I want to see to make it okay? I digitized them after the millennium and started putting them up on YouTube. And then it just sort of went nuts. The original keyboard cat, we always called Fatso because that was came from when she was born. A friend named Heidi Hawkins dropped off some cats for my girlfriend and I. We were just getting married. So she gave us Fatso and Skinny. Fatso had more hair and Skinny had less, but they were both pretty skinny if you got them all wet. One day, it was time to make a fun video because there was nothing else to do. All I had was a camera and a cat and a keyboard. And so this thing just sort of just went together. Try to imagine a cold, sort of unemployed, uh, slightly hungry pack of three dangerous white boys. What was happening was some friends of mine and I were getting together to use his new video camera because his wife was mad he bought one. We just make, would take turns making these videos. And so it was my turn and there were those objects, you know, just that keyboard and the cat and that little shirt. So I just held the cat up so he looked right and Put that little shirt on him and but we got that take out of her and that first take of that thing there was only two takes it was really delightfully shocking you know um, and certainly we didn't plan that how could you challenge other people to take your video and mix it with one of their choice there's three keyboard cats so far they can't live that long because from 84 to now it's a, you know a new world and we've been through generations of cats but they always somehow incorporate each other's persona and in fact um, bento was a reincarnation of fatso bento's history is a mile deep 10 miles deep it happened with me talking to my manager ben lashes and asking him what should i do should i make some new t-shirt designs or whatever and he goes no you should get another orange cat and an old camera and a keyboard and do this again because we were selling that one low res clip left and right two three times a day europe Asia all over the place. So I just got in the car and started driving to the shelters and I got a pattern of where, where they were and every day for like a week, I would go to all of them. I met Bento and his names just came out of, because Ben is the manager and we got him home and, and he just turned out to be a miracle cat. I swear to God, like the first week with this new cat, and the first video is called Keyboard Cat Reincarnated. We sold it to Microsoft they, at their request for a, it was a good pile of dough. I, I'm, I sort of feel at home with the internet culture about that. People can't just take our brand and use it to make money without talking to us about it first. However, there are, are a lot of other things in between you can do. The Iraq everywhere like such as and I believe that they should our education over here. Well, I think the one where the, where the girl is running like for school office or something and she's saying that, that in the third world countries such as they, uh, we need to like have more maps printed. That, that one's pretty darn good. Cause just like, man, just think about that girl. If you think scumbag Steve didn't like posts, Think about that girl. Oh, ouch. <laughs> it makes me smile that for some reason. It's just like I couldn't, I can't get rid of the smile. That's a good thing. I think people really, really responded to Keyboard Cat in such a viral fashion because it gave them a short, predictable, guaranteed laugh. And because he's cute. Some things are viral, but they're not cute. And it's much easier if you have something cute. That much I can tell you, because people just go, yeah, well, it's so darn cute. 
Well, if if Fatso is paying attention to what we're doing today on this on this screen, and I'm sure that she is, if you die and go to Cat Heaven and you could say you were keyword cat, you get extra privileges, I'm sure of it. There's some. Come on. But anyway, she'd love it, I think. She just viciously. It's been very positive, a very positive experience to watch the evolution of that in the old days with my video, first video camera. And then now you can just take anything that you do. I mean, even like exactly what we're doing at this moment, grab it and package it and put it online globally in half a dozen different locations in a matter of moments. Well, I sure would like to thank every, any and everyone who's joined in here, paid some attention to some of this. Please uh, don't hesitate to visit charlieschmidt.com because there you can find everything, all this junk I've been talking about and more. Plus you can get some pretty good t-shirts and stuff. Hey, nice job down there in Know Your Meme world. You guys are, have a good way of making it easy.